Hello everyone, let's move further towards our another activity. First, you just have to trace down a circle and you just have to trim down this sheet of the paper in the circular sheet. Now, you just have to fold it. You just have to repeat this with the different multiple colorful sheets of the paper and you just have to roll it down over this straw and it's going to represent an umbrella. Let's try to make this cute little frocks. For this one, you may require some colorful sheets of the paper. Now, you just have to fold them from both the ends as shown here. Just pause the video so that you can follow the each step properly and try to make these cute little frocks. If we talk about the difficulty level, then this one is very simple and it's really less time consuming. Also, best suitable for the kids between the age group of 8 to 10. For this one, you may require the straight stripe of the paper and you just have to fold it in the opposite direction one after the another in the alternative manner and after that you just have to fold it down using a double sided tape and the features of this bunny like the eyes, nose and the legs are to be used to be fixed together with the help of the glue stick. For this one, you may require some colorful pattern sheets of the paper and you just have to trim it down according to the shape of the butterfly at the center. You just have to insert, we can say, a bamboo stick or even you can make use of some straw so that you can hold it and for this one, you may require some pattern sheet of the paper that are trimmed down according to the shape of the ears. After that, you just have to fold it from upper portion and from the lower portion as well. Just pause the video so that you don't get confused and follow the each step properly in a sequential manner from both the ends. You just have to make a circular shape at the center so that you can place some items in the center. For this one, you may require some multiple colorful sheets of the paper and you can definitely give them a try. For this one, I'm taking this double-sided sheet of the paper and these are actually the blue and the pinkish shades. And after that, you just have to fold it at the center. After that, you just have to again unfold it. You can just pause the video so that you can see where you just have to make the folds and where you just have to make some of the creases and where you just have to unfold it so that you can make it properly. Now, I'm taking some another shade of the paper that's actually, we can say, yellow and the green one. And then after that, you just have to place it at the center. This activity is again very simple and again very easy. Definitely give it a try. Here I'm going to make use of some another shade of the paper. That's the red and the yellow one. And you just have to again fold it and you just have to insert it at the center area. This activity is very simple. Let's move further and try to make these hanging rabbits. For this one, you just have to make use of some pattern sheet of the paper and you just have to fold it at the center. It's square sheet of the paper. Once you have folded it, you just have to again make a fold diagonally from both the ends as shown here. Now you just open it and you can see the creases are made. You just have to follow the each crease and you just have to fold it there. Just pause the video and don't get confused because here the patterns are made and it might be very difficult for you to remember where you just have to make the folds for perfection and for not repeating it again and again. Just pause the video and you can slow down the speed of this video so that you can follow the each step properly. It's best suitable for the kids between the age group of 11 to 12 and you can see you can hang it with the help of some thread or any jute fiber. Let's move further towards our another activity. Here we are going to show you how we can make this cute multiple color toy out of some sheet of the paper. First, you just have to take the square sheet of the paper. You just have to fold it from both ends. After that, you just have to unfold it. And you can see these heart shapes are made. Now, you just have to repeat the same process with the different colorful sheets of the paper. Now, fix them one after the another from one edge. This is very really cute and easy. Definitely give it a try. 